everybody, Skylar here, and today I wanted to talk to you about JP Morgan launching their own cryptocurrency. So I was actually getting getting ready to make a video on Amazon on some rumors on Amazon, and then I saw this story and decided this was much more interesting. But uh, essentially, JP Morgan, which is interesting because Jamie Dimon, the CEO of JP Morgan, has been talking trash on cryptocurrency and Bitcoin, and uh, you know his his main point is no, the government's not going to let a currency take over its own, and it's going to shut down any currency that they can't control. Now I can understand the logic behind that, and I do agree that the government would want to shut it down if if it, if it became something that that took that you know took their currency over completely. Like I can understand how. A lot of people in the government wouldn't like that not being in control. Um, that being said, when he says things like the government's going to shut it down, they can't shut it down. At most, they can ban, you know, the the people in the United States from buying it, but it doesn't mean that you you can. There's always going to be a way to, and you know, and and if you're not in the United States, there's other countries that are legal. So you, you know, it's it's still going to be used and in fact unless there's just there only needs to be two computers running the network for bitcoin to be running so i don't see every single person in the entire world not even two people running the network so when people say things like bitcoin's going to zero they either don't know what they're talking about or they're purposely trying to instill fear into people so uh at any rate he ended up launching his own cryptocurrency, and he ended up doing it with um, with Quorum, which we've actually um, kind of known about. It's a, an Ethereum based. It's a it's a enterprise version of the Ethereum blockchain developed by J.P. Morgan, and uh, I don't know if, if it's going to be. I mean, the the rumor was gold bars. Uh, it's backed by the U.S. dollar which we're not in the gold standard anymore, even though a lot of people think we are. Um, but yeah, pretty uh, pretty, pretty big news. Uh, I'll, I'll post some of the articles here so you can check it out, but <clears throat> um, let me go through some of the use cases, <laughs> some articles of, of, uh, of Jamie Dimon calling Bitcoin a fraud and while he was busted for money laundering. By the way, this is kind of like one of the reasons. One of the reasons why I think Bitcoin will succeed is is because I feel like we're as each generation comes, they become less and less agreeable with all the bull crap that's that's out there right now with with the way things are being done. I feel like I'm kind of beat down when I hear you know. I mean, I could read a story that you know, you know some you know you know high politician got busted for you know defrauding you know a, a a half a trillion dollars worth of you know whatever americans money and nobody goes to jail that's a very normal thing to me i would be like yeah figures you know and that shouldn't be acceptable like when when things when you know when when awful things happen there should be consequences um but at any rate you know there's never any consequences to these people that have tons of money. So that's one of the one of the many reasons I think Bitcoin will will survive is because nobody can control it. Everybody's on the same playing field. Um, but uh, at any rate, let's go back. Let's go back to the article. So um, here it is. So let me just kind of read this section. So, uh, while JP Morgan has laid out the hopes, what it'll do with JPM coin, it has been less tr transparent what the technical details of the to um, has been less transparent of the d technical details of the token. Jeez, uh, that raises the question: What does the bank mean by cryptocurrency? It's clear that JPM coin will exist on a blockchain. However, the bank has not yet revealed what that blockchain would look like, as well as the level of control JP Morgan will retain over its ledger. So, so I mean, when, when I I pretty much think this. I mean, the way I look at it is it's XRP, um, but but it's not controlled. You know, by Ripple, it's controlled by J.P. Morgan. 
So um, it's a stable coin. So um, let's see. Yeah, it says right here, Jamie Dimon. So JP Morgan says that its cryptocurrency would uh, could serve as sort of a corporate stable coin. But, you know, they're worth trillions of dollars. So um, having, you know, the word cryptocurrency and blockchain, and it, you know, with a huge bank out there it is big news one you know, one way or another. So at any rate, I just wanted to share that with you. I know, um, you know, the, it just came out. Uh, in fact, the 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 um, an hour and 20 minutes ago is the uh, first story that I found on the Internet that, that talked about this. So um, I will follow up on this absolutely in the next you know two three days. There's going to be a lot more information about this, and I will follow it closely. So uh, I super appreciate you know everybody who watched. Comment below and and tell me what you think about it, um, about JPM coin, and you know what you think that it means for Bitcoin. And uh, I'm really curious what everybody thinks. So yeah, leave a comment below. I super appreciate anybody watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you want to you know, follow up. I make these videos every single day. And um, all the money I make always goes to nonprofit um, on this channel as well as a couple other projects that I do. So um, at any rate, super appreciate everybody. See you next week. Bye.